All right, guys, welcome to High School Engineering. Come on in. Today we're gonna see the fifth graders and the seniors work on projects where they're gonna repurpose plastics. The project was to reuse a plastic bottle in, in a form that we feel it make it profitable. Emilio is one that, that leads with vision and he leads with courage. I came up with a problem that needed a solution. We do not have enough students of color accessing high paying jobs in the STEM fields. His vision was to create a pathway, a five through 12 pathway in STEM for our families. It was evident that he just had these goals in his head and he was going to accomplish them. Emilio is just an amazing leader, an amazing human being, um, and I think what he symbolizes as a Latino male in this um, landscape is really important. Are you in bio? Are you in biomed? Okay, how are you liking it? Yes. He's very driven, very passionate about what he's doing in his own schools, but also just about all the children in LA. It's very clear the vision that Emilio has of we're agents of change, we're family. We're STEM thinkers. Instruction comes first, so let's just have the regular PD. Everything he does is based on those three core values. Group, anything to add to that one? Emilio is the co-chair of the LAAC. The Los Angeles Advocacy Council is a collection of 17 school leaders. And this group of leaders is coming together to really, really lead the charge for advocacy and how we can transform Los Angeles. Emilio is one of those very special leaders that is a very great educator to begin with. But on top of that, he also understands the importance of advocacy and he's such a compelling leader. He brings his colleagues together in ways that'll give them the courage to take that next step on behalf of kids. With the Los Angeles Advocacy Council leading the charge, what we've really done is be able to create a collective voice in Los Angeles. When there is unfairness, that there is this collection of charter leaders that can engage the larger charter community to really, really try to push for change. Five, four, three, two, one, <laughs> tools down. I see Dr. Pack as a, you know, as a mentor and more as like an idol I, that I admire. And I hope that everybody else could see him like that. Emilio is going to continue to fight for this community. To me, charter school and charter school reform is so important and I'll do anything it takes to fight for that right for kids to have educational quality options. I am going to give the award to this group over here. I think he's the perfect person for this award. Um, he is a visionary. He is somebody who's pushing the conversation um, and somebody who I think we should look out for in the coming years because I think he's headed for more greatness.